Hi guys. Um, I just wanted to come on and show everyone how to do the application of Hair Savior. Um, it's been a popular product and I have a lot of questions and I kind of try to explain it as best as I can. It's also listed step-by-step -step on my website at www.shophairbychristina.ca. Um, but I'm going to kind of show you that how to apply it and I'm going to show you what I do and I often try to do this anywhere from one to two times a week. Um, I will sometimes even do it three times a week if possible. I don't always wash my hair that often, uh, but as two to three times a week is recommended for the most hair growth. Um, hair Savior is meant for nourishing the scalp. It's meant for creating hair growth and uh, speeding up hair growth. Anyone with alopecia or dandruff, it will kind of help and um, repair the scalp, nourish the scalp that way. Um, it's made from all natural ingredients and it's actually locally made. So it's supporting that whole small business, um, support small business that we're all kind of rallying for these days. Um, it is all natural ingredients. Uh, there is almond oil and coconut oil. So uh, anyone that has any allergies, uh, just note. Uh, but the main ingredient is rosemary and rosemary is meant to uh, stimulate the scalp. So that's the whole idea behind it. So this is the cute little packaging that it comes in and it's $39 a bottle, but I'm gonna show you kind of how I apply it. So you wanna kind of section your hair. This is done on a dirty hair day. Unlike traditional treatments that are done when your hair is clean, um, this is something you wanna put on your hair when it's dirty and you know you're gonna wash it that night or the next day. So in my case, I'm gonna wash it tomorrow morning. So I'm gonna put it in now, keep it in all day and wash it uh, tomorrow morning. So I'm gonna kinda start and show you how it's done. So you take a dropper and you wanna kind of apply a couple drops to your part and rub it in, just gently, nothing rough. You wanna kinda be gentle on the scalp and gentle on the hair. Then you're gonna take another section. Often these corners are where we have uh, issues and this is actually why I started using hair savior this is about six months of growth six months worth of growth right here um, postpartum this kind of area wasn't growing back in as much um, so that's when I personally started using hair savior and noticed that I absolutely loved it and like these areas are still growing in and they make me super happy so I'm going to take that section I'm going to make sure I apply there just a couple drops and again just rub it in I'm gonna to go to the next section and you can kind of do this in any area that you find that you wanna nourish that scalp to get hair growth or stimulate new hair growth, stimulate the follicle, that sort of idea. So you're gonna to go to the next section and do the same thing. You can do this all the way through the back, just a few drops, rub it in through your roots. Okay, so now this is everywhere on your scalp. Um, you can also kind of put it back here at the crown, which I like to do, because why not try to grow more hair back there? <laughs> Get a little bit more volume. So that's the idea. So the whole point now is to go through the scalp and just massage it a little bit, just kind of get that uh, product distributed through the hair. And by massaging it as well, you're also getting um, stimulation to the scalp. Some more areas. Perfect. So now what I do is I also recommend to use it as a full hair treatment. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I part my hair down the center in the back. I take actually one full dropper and distribute it in my hair and kind of run it everywhere through one side. And I'll take another full dropper, put it in my hand, rub it through, and put it everywhere on that side. Okay, so just rubbing it through, rubbing it in the back of the scalp, and any areas that you know, you're kind of worried about or you feel that are thinning, you can take a little bit of extra time and massage it through that area. 
So now that it's fully in, you take your wet brush and kind of comb it through. And this will distribute it nicely right through the roots to the ends. Um, the wet brush has super flexible bristles, so it's not scraping the scalp or hurting it in any way. It'll just help kind of distribute. Uh, my ends are a little drier, so I'm gonna take a little bit more and just rub it right through my ends. Okay. So now that your product is in, generally I like to just put it in a ponytail for the day, or you can braid it and wear it, um, leave it in overnight. And then in the morning, you shampoo it out as usual, two shampoos and follow with your conditioner and your product. And that's how you do it. So I hope I answered any questions. Um, if um, you have any questions at any point, you can touch base with me. Um, you can send me a DM through the website. Um, any questions at all, I'm happy to help. And uh, they're also both, uh, the wet brush and the hair saver are both available online. So if you want to try it, there's a few extra tips there as well under the product page, okay? Hope that helped. Thank you, everyone. Bye.